Okay, folks, it is now uh, about 20 after 4 a.m. on Saturday morning of the following weekend. I've got everything cleared out of here. I got that nasty carpet torn up, and I don't know what happened. Looks like somebody was painting some stuff in here before. Looks like there's something written down there or something, but can't read it. But the issue I've got now is. The floor is rotted out right in this area here and in this corner from about right here to the to the edge of the wall there. And I'm trying to decide how I want to address that. Um, the problem is right on the roof, right in this area, there's a big dent in the, in the metal roof and all the water just pulls up there and just gushes down the outside of this outside wall right here on, on the top of this window then down and I've tried to fix it many times tried to there's a little there's a small gutter up there I've tried to seal that up and but it just gets the water just gets behind it and overflows it and just runs right down and I've sealed the top of that window several times I'm not sure if it's actually leaking into the window or not but uh but it's going down the inside of the wall and it's now it's floor is all rotted out there and it's into the paneling. I'm not going to replace the paneling. I'm just going to cover it up. But right now, it's still wet right there because it's been raining. It was raining pretty hard yeah, all day yesterday. So uh, I'm trying to decide whether to uh, cut that section of the floor out and replace it. Or brace it up from underneath, or just let it go. Because <laughs> um, I'm gonna put, be putting carpet or some kind of other flooring in here. I might be able to use the carpet that I had planned on that wasn't turned out to be in not in good shape, but um, I'll figure it out. I'm a little bit afraid to cut into the floor right there though, because I know there's a this water line running under there close somewhere and there might be a 220 electrical line that's either in the wall or in the floor right in this area that leads up to the stove which is on this side of the house so uh, I don't know I'm not gonna cut it tonight I've been up I'm gonna go to bed right now but uh and I still gotta strip all the trim pieces and all the nails and bits out of the walls and um, the outlet covers and stuff. I'm going to take those off. All these junk pieces of trim, these are all going to go bye-bye. I'm getting rid of them completely. So so we'll go from there. Have a good day. We'll talk to you later. Goodbye.